Hi everyone, welcome to Weekly Devotions for Kids. This week's Bible verse comes from 2 Timothy 3.16. It says, All scripture is God-breathed and is useful for teaching, rebuking, correcting, and training in righteousness. Let's talk about what this means before we begin learning this verse. All scripture, that means God's word, the Bible, every single bit of it is God-breathed or comes from God. We know God spoke to many in the Bible, and He told them what to write. Everything we read in the Bible can be used to teach us. We can learn about the character of God, how we are children of God and loved by Him, and even the rules God gives us to live by, not only to protect us, but also to live at peace with God. Rebuking is pointing out and warning us against our sin, or the wrong choices we make that go against what God has told us to do. Bible verses help to correct our behavior. When we realize what we are doing goes against God's word, we have the Holy Spirit in our lives that helps us make better choices. Training in righteousness means that God is equipping or giving us what we need and preparing us to be like Him. Only God is fully righteous, but through Jesus we are also made righteous. So what is the importance of this verse? This verse tells us that everything written in it is important. God doesn't waste his words in the Bible, but uses them to make us more like Jesus. Let's get to memorizing. Please repeat after me. All scripture is God breathed and is useful for teaching, Rebuking, correcting, and training in righteousness. Second Timothy three sixteen. Great, let's do it again. All scripture is God breathed and is useful for teaching. Rebuking, correcting, and training in righteousness. Second Timothy three sixteen. Now please listen to me one more time. All scripture is God breathed and is useful for teaching, rebuking, correcting, and training in righteousness. Second Timothy three sixteen. Come back each day of this week and practice your memory verse. By the end of the week, you should be able to do it all by yourself without repeating after me. But before we go, let's pray. This week, try to remember to pray each day for the Bible to help you become more like Jesus. I would love to pray for you right now. Dear Jesus, I thank you for my friends who are watching today. I pray that my friends would trust in your word to be true and that you would help them to do what the Bible says. May you bless my friends this week. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Thank you for joining me today. See you next week.